Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. This is lecture series 28, Introduction to IoT, dealing with Model Question Paper Discussion Module 4. In previous videos, we have seen and discussed about some of the model question uh, questions from different uh, years question paper, which covers module 1, 2 and 3. So this is from module 4. These are the some important questions. Define virtualization, discuss the advantages of virtualization. Totally it covers 8 marks. Summarize the case study related to smart irrigation management system which covers 5 marks. With the help of neat diagram, explain the type of cloud models 7 marks. So the R choice will be with the neat diagram, explain architecture of sensor cloud platform, which is eight marks. And with neat diagram, explain components of an agriculture IoT is five marks. With the help of neat diagram, describe the difference between network and cloud computing will be seven marks. So here you will be seeing about the different question. First, make uh, first understand one thing. When you read the question, read your question properly. So how the question is split up. If you see the first question, define ritualization, discuss advantages of ritualization. It is clearly understood that first the definition should be there. Then you have to list down the advantages and each advantages has to be explained thoroughly. So which will be totally containing eight marks. So like that, when, when you read the question, you should be clear of what answer should be written. So define, define ritualization, discuss advantages of ritualization. So you know what is ritualization. So definition of that ritualization will contain two marks and discuss the advantages of ritualization. You can, uh, you can draw these two diagrams for the definition of ritualization telling the difference between normal desktop and a ritualization system. So that can be given where that diagram consists of one marks and the advantages can be listed down and each of the advantages can be explained. So that will be of two marks. Totally, it is of five marks. Next question, summarize the case study related to smart irrigation management system. So here you can see that summarize the case study. So obviously, when you're going to explain the case study, you will be explaining with a neat diagram. So first draw the diagram where the diagram contains two marks and you will be explaining about the different layer. So you have sensing and actuating layer, processing and service layer and application layer. So one, layer one, layer two, layer three. So all these layer will be explained thoroughly like, like where the sensors are used, what kind of sensors are used, how the data from the sensor are processed to the application layer. All those will be explained. So the explanation will contain three marks totally out of five marks. Next question, with the help of neat diagram, explain the types of cloud models. So you will be writing what is cloud model. For the safer side, you should write it. And you will be drawing this diagram because with the help of the neat diagram, so this will be your diagram where you will be specifying completely like cloud module is divided into two types. And those two types has different types of clouds. All those will be explained. And you can completely explain all these model precisely so the explanation will have five marks so totally it is of seven marks so the or choice now with a neat diagram explain architecture of sensor cloud platform so sensor cloud platform the diagram should be first drawn where they have mentioned neat diagram so draw the diagram where diagram has two marks and you can start explaining about end user web interface sensor owners deployed sensor nodes cloud all those so that explanation will co consist of four marks and you will be writing about the respective views like uh, in sensor point of view or in customer point of view how the platform will be so all those views you will be explaining in detail so which will be having two marks so totally you can uh, completely write it for eight marks. Next, with a neat diagram, explain components of an agricultural IoT. So for agricultural IoT, draw the diagram where the diagram will have two marks and you will be explaining about sensor, camera, satellite, analytics, all these components will be explained thoroughly. So make sure your explanation is for only three marks because it totally it contains five marks. So explanation will be three marks. So you can precisely explain, don't detailly explain each and every devices. You can precisely explain. So the explanation 
consists of 3 marks, totally 5 marks. Last question. With the help of NEAT diagram, describe the difference between the network computing and cloud computing. So you can start with first point as what is network computing and cloud computing. You can differentiate. So that will be for one mark. And here you can draw this diagram for network computing and for cloud computing. This diagram, this will contain another one mark. So two marks is over. Now you will be explaining this diagram. So what user is doing. So that will be another one mark, which is three marks. And here you will be telling how the data are interconnected or the uh, sources are interconnected. So that will be the fourth point, which, which, which has four points. Similarly, here also you'll be telling about the user and how it has been connected to pool of servers, sorry, pool of uh, users. So you'll be telling that which uh, totally has four marks. Now total marks is seven. Another three more marks you need. So another three more marks you can have example for network computing and cloud computing, applications of cloud computing and network computing. With that you can cover it for seven marks. So you you if it if you have this word in your question difference between, then make sure you are differentiating each other rather than writing it in. Uh, paragraphs differentiate from one end to the other end network computing and cloud computing so stay tuned for the other module important questions module 5 thank you